Well, folks, uh, welcome to Labyrinth TV Network. And my name is Loy Nyonyo Fali. Today we are in Zreju. I want to bring you another exciting and developing story uh, at Victoria Spring. It is a well-organized structure that is run by one of uh, Grandidians who is based here. And of course, this is the road, as you can see, uh, from in town Zreju, and which is entering. You have access to the facility. And this is the road that is heading to Niao. Folks, again, uh, there are a lot of exciting things that you will see here at the Vitura Spring, where you have a hall, you have a lot of facilities. See how decent this place is. It is. This is Labyrinth TV Network with me, Law Fadi. Good of it. Uh, the CEO is here and he will be able to tour us around and tell us more about this facility. What this is all about. His vision for the people of Grand Jira County and where we hope to see Grand Jira County heading. One other thing I can tell you, Liberians are the ones that can build Liberia. This is a direct replica or what's it hap what is happening in Grand Jira. Grand Jirians are building Grand Jira County. Folks, welcome and thanks for joining us. Luckily for me, my visit here today, the CEO of uh, this era is here. I'm the CEO, welcome to Labyrinth TV Network. You, thank you, you're welcome. But uh, just so uh, Bill White will be fine. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, Mr. Okay. Bill, Mr. Bill White. <laughs> yeah. uh, tell us about you, quickly. Just within maybe uh, a second or 30 minutes. Well, um, you know, this is our county. We um, we um, were born here in the Barris. We went to school here, uh, Cali School, all the way from first grade to, to uh, 12th grade, which are really high. And they walk in, and uh, some of us were forced in it to leave the country and go somewhere where we could gain something, and we did. And so after so many years, decided to come back home and uh, what my father has started or was doing, somebody met me once and said, you're gonna be here in the States and all your father's property is gonna go to waste. And that hit me. We were at a, some kind of reception, I can't remember, but uh, I felt kind of bad about it. Okay. And then decided to come home and see what we could do. Okay, thanks so much. This facility have attracted uh, so many Liberians, especially uh, in fact, Grandidians. Now we are here. Can you please tell us about uh, this facility? Why is it for? Why is it doing here? It's supposed to be in Morovia, as I always say, and it is in Zreju. Yeah. Well, um, we acquired this land probably eight years ago. Okay. Um, and uh, when the people brought me to show it to me, there's a swamp in the middle. Okay. And um, as I was looking at the swarm, I started to get this vision of something can be done here. Okay. And we used to have a park in Zredru, somewhere in uh, on Conway Street. Okay. Uh, and uh, I thought maybe we could kind of create the same thing here and uh, see how we can bring part of the old life or part of America back to, to Liberia, okay. especially to Grand Chile. Okay. Uh, so my wife, uh, Victoria, Vicky, I thought we call her, okay. said that she wanted a I mean, uh, event, an event hall. Okay. And so I was thinking about the park, and then she was thinking about event hall. And I kind of was, didn't want to take the space to put a building there. I just wanted more of the park, and I love trees. Okay. Okay. But then later on, with the help of uh, one of our local popular work guy here, uh, and, and my brother, Luigi, we, we designed this building. I kind of put a rough, rough uh, sketch down, okay. chicken scratch, okay. get them my ideas, and then uh, they would just sketch it off for me. And then the, the popular like, work uh, resident here drew up the, the plans for me. Okay. And then this is where the, the grounds, the parks like area, mm -hmm. we call Victoria Springs. Okay. Because that, that swamp had a little place in there where water was always coming out of it. Okay. Okay. And then the building, the hall inside, we call Tory V Hall. So, is it possible that we go in? Sure, sir. 
And so you hear from him there, this is quite interesting. I can tell you, if you enter Grand G there, this is somewhere you will let to come and see, seriously. Wow. Folks, they play that as Red Jew. Let me speak the simple like that Grand G there, yeah. In America, in our Moravia, in our Ganta, this is happening right here in his Red Jew, Grand G there. County. Tell us about the hall. Okay. So, uh, welcome uh, to Victoria Hall. Uh, we have it set up this way so that we can show you that we can go auditorium style okay. or we can go cafeteria style. Okay. Okay. And on cafeteria style, we can host about roughly 330, 350 people in their chairs and table. And then auditorium style, we can do to about 430. Uh, 470. Okay. If we extend up into the uh, inside lobby right here, okay. our stage mm -hmm. we made it where it's uh, portable. We can move it okay. to any part of the hall. So if you wanted it in the middle, we can put it in the middle. Okay. And that's the largest. We can reduce it to as small as you want. Okay. And then we can also put it on the side so okay. that we can sit down. Uh, 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 what we call it, uh, stadium style, where you kind of sit around. They put the stage and you sit around it. Some of the things that we try to do here is use a lot of the local things that we could, mm -hmm. and I'm very proud of our ceiling. You see the ceiling here, it's all our regular bamboo that we wow. see, natural bamboo we see, and we use it in the whole building. And uh, there's a gentleman that we got this that got this made for us. Uh, his name is Morris G. from right here from Tufetan. Okay. It took us about a year and a half to get all of this. Okay. But, okay, but as he did it, he did 10, 15, 5 a week. We'll go get it. We we'll, we'll kept uh, packing it until we got what we needed. And so we put a ceiling up. The entire building is air conditioned. Okay. And that's, that, that way I was just heading, especially when it comes to ventilation, you'll be having or close to uh, 1,000 people in a hall. And so somebody would like you to talk about the ventilation. Yeah, the total building is air conditioned. Okay. okay. We have uh, 22 air conditions. And it's a multi purpose building. We have two conference rooms. Okay. Okay. And you have female re uh, uh, male restaurant. Okay. And then if you come with me this way. Okay. <clears throat> And uh, this conference room is time we call CR80. We can hold up to 80 persons. Okay. Okay. So we will arrange it to your taste. Okay. Conference room. Let's see how we do. Conference room. And so we can have it like this, and we can take this is set right now for 50. Okay. Uh, we have an occasion coming Monday, and uh, we're gonna it's gonna be 56. So we have it. We'll, we'll get uh, six more chairs in here. Okay, maybe a, a couple of tables. So you want to have workshop training? It is also available. Oh, yeah. Even parties, you got little personal parties. You want to have little personal parties in here? We can do that in here also. Okay. If you see our ceiling also, it's our own local design. Mm -hmm. Okay, we kind of did the drop ceiling. We face it on the ground and then we put it up there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Well, folks, as you hear from uh, Mr. Bill White, he, he, he said people should call you Bill White, nobody should call you CEO. But he's the chief executive officer for uh, the Bill White Enterprise, uh, which of course we know way back. And now today we have the Victoria Spring. And you said the name of the hall again? The hall is Tory V Hall. Tory V. R I, capital V I I. Okay. Tory V Hall. This is Ari. Ari Shaki, she's a manager here. Okay. Thank you the place, responsible for the place. Okay. She help her keep it in order, keep the place looking clean as, it, like it, as you see it. Okay. Right. So quickly, quickly, uh, uh, how do people get in contact with you, perhaps if they want to use uh, the facility? Okay. Our email address is Triangle Enterprise 1959 at Gmail. Okay. Okay. And our telephone number is 777 8787. I'm sorry, 777, yes, 87, 87, 88. Okay. And okay. then uh, Lone Star will be uh, 887, 222, okay. 887. Somebody will come for maybe uh, uh, vacation, come to see their family, traveling all the way from the States or from diaspora. Is there any way they come to do relaxation, just come and sit quietly, observe the day? And, you know, is it happening here as well? Sure. We have, um, we'll come this way. Okay. We'll show you, give us a few minutes. We have, a, we have, like I said, we had a park. That my idea was more for park and yes. we'll talk about the the uh, event hall. So okay. we have, a, outside, we'll show you later, the outside area, we got a park line. Okay. But uh, before we step outside while we're in here, mm -hmm. we have, um, 
this is our restroom. We call I mean, sorry, our other conference room. Okay. We will call Sierra 20. Okay. So it's set up for 20, but we can get a little bit more, say maybe about another 10 more, so we can get up the problem. Yeah, because you still have space okay. around. Okay. We have uh, monitors. You see our drive board, like in this, all like I say, everything is air conditioned. Okay. All right. Okay. That's good. And so it's all happening here in his radio. Grand Jide County, folks. Uh, let me say thanks for joining us and keep following Labyrinth TV Network. Uh, this is uh, so one of our restrooms. Okay. okay. Very clean. As you can see, very clean. Sorry. Okay. And this is for the meal? Yeah, meal restroom. Okay. Yeah, yeah, the meal on the other side. Okay. And then. The office is not the uh, furnished okay. Okay. yet, but this is our office. Okay. This is okay. where the manager will be. Yeah, manager will be. A full okay. bathroom. Okay. All right. And then this is, uh, I like to say, the best part of the house. Yeah, the, the kitchen. kitchen. <laughs> yeah. Okay. The powerhouse. Yeah. And uh, if you have an occasion, we will also cool your drinks. You let us have it 24 hours before the, the, the event. Okay. We'll cool the drinks also. And then you can warm up things here. We got the rolling trays and all that. We got the running water and, and all that in here. Okay. okay. Wow. All right. Easy. Yeah. The water is flowing. Over. <laughs> okay. 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 Then we have our store room. Store room here. Oh, oh, okay. And then this is our outside kitchen. Okay. Okay. So they can do maybe if you right if you get uh, you, you buy goat, they can roast it here. Yeah, we got somewhere we can do that. Thank also. you. Thank you. That's okay. good. So we are now outdoor uh, again. As you can see, so these are have, air conditions. Yeah. So we uh, have a couple of benches in here, so people can come in here, sit. We got a water tower. We got a home over there. Okay. And then this building here is where we have our building superintendent. Okay. It's a family, uh, James and his wife, or uh, uh, Chami lives in here. Oh, okay. And then we plans that we're gonna have a uh, 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 there's uh, two bedrooms here bed and bath and so we're going to have something you have to be able to spend maybe a couple of days or so okay yeah also and then under the building we have two apartments okay two bedrooms so we have one on this side we got one on the other side okay so you uh, use the route to go there yeah so it's a little bit dark no no it's okay uh, let's just talk about it okay, then we're right, learning about okay. yeah yeah Okay, that's good. So it means that anybody want to have time, if you come to have holidays, yeah. you can have place to, to stay. Right. Okay. And then uh, we have section like this, where we have, uh, you see the place to roast your meat? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So we have five of these set up, so we can roast the meat here. Okay. And then if you subscribe, we got a big table over there, and then yeah. the a rest. Okay. Wow. So all the way back there, all extended. The way back there. So is there any route to go there? Okay, that's right. good. And you see, we have a deck here, so you can bring like, like the, the you can bring your mattress. Okay. You can bring your lapa. You can just lie down. Right right <laughs> yeah. This and is then, interesting, uh, folks. Here, this is this is the swamp. We, okay. Uh, we clean it uh, twice, and we'll do it again when we get it done. And uh, what we do, we just try to leave it there. You see, we're looking at the natural things. We got yeah. The birds going and coming. Uh, building the nest, that's the sound. natural. You can sit there, look at them, and you can yeah. get from them. For sure. They do. sure. And they are building a nest as well. Yeah. Well, folks, keep following Labrin TV. We are heading to uh, the other part of it. This is uh, right here in Grand Jida County. And uh, of course, it will interest you to know that um, there are a lot of facilities here that you can explore, come, have a time with the people and or have a realization. Even the students that are attending the university, you can, you know, like Saturdays, Sundays, you come with your books, you sit, you read, you know, for, for, to, to avoid noise, right? And so, folks, it is, it is, it is, it is very much um, exciting. Uh, to be here, folks, wherever you are. Keep following Labyrinth TV Network, and we are on the other side. As you can see from there, that's the beauty. Okay, we're still here. Okay, so now we, uh, we're just coming from the Victoria, I mean, from uh, Tory V Hall. Okay. And so now we're in the Victoria Spring part, most of it right here. Okay. Okay, so we have the benches, and then if you just turn back here, you see we put this dam here. The water was much lower. Like I said, it was a swamp.